So first, a couple of things that I want to go, general points. Um, as was already mentioned by the event host, we do have melee weapons, so I'm sure your players know about that. If they don't, you can use the save start to remind them. Just uh, don't have any casualties during save start to be able to take test swings of their sobbles. That would be problematic. Secondly, as mentioned in the mission plan, keep the protective equipment on at all times. That means your gas mask. There is some type of false mug hanging over this city, and we do not know its source. So protective equipment on at all times. Don't take it off. And thirdly, remember, the enemy here represents an acute moral threat. You know, whatever heresies they have done to this planet, the civilian population, or themselves, cannot be allowed to change our own soldiers. So looting of any kind is strictly forbidden. You will not touch the enemy bodies unless absolutely necessary in close combat. And when I mean no looting, that means absolutely nothing. You don't take medicals from them, you don't take ammunition from them, you don't take docked access trophies, you don't look into their inventory to see what they're carrying. Just stay away from that filth. We, it could spread some type of corruption. And this will be enforced. I have received special exemption from the event admin to modify the normal AFI rules concerning friendly fire. The commissar and myself will send players to respawn via field execution if they fail to follow orders, including the looting and gas mask usage. Gas mask usage. Obviously, we don't want to do this, so I'm counting on you that being the squad leaders to keep your guys in line. Hallowed be his name. Finally, this is um, CLTVT and it is a themed event. So, in case, you know, if you see some things that don't make sense, either because they are bugs or they are creative decisions by the mission maker that you don't agree with, you know, just roll with it. You know, let's do our best not to highlight stuff that, you know, could detract from other players' experience from the mission. Even if you don't like them. Because sometimes, you know, bugs and weirdness should be expected. You know, let's act in a way befitting the Emperor's soldiers here tonight. Alright, that's the general part. And uh, no changes to the mission plan itself. Um, it's fairly straightforward. The we don't have much room to, room to maneuver in the city, so we just try to barrel through with maximum firepower on narrow lane of advance. Uh, just quickly recap what we do at the game start. After save start, all retribution elements will mark along the marked blue path that is slightly downhill. You might not able to see the elevation from the map, but if we follow the route, the enemy won't be able to us in, even if they have sentries at the extreme edge of their allowed deployment area. Best case scenario, we can follow that path all the way up to Alpha 4, Alpha 6, before we are even spotted. We will leave our vehicles behind so that they don't use their engines to give away our attack. And maybe we can surprise the enemy. Of Retribution 1 and 2, we'll attack through block Alpha 6, heading towards the Beta 1 area. Retribution 3 and 4, we'll advance along ASR Secundus, clearing Hab block Alpha 7 if necessary. And then they will push on to Hangar 1 to establish fire superiority over the Manufactorum. Alabaster will be hiding at F5, ready to flank the enemy, or to, on our call, engage the enemy Astartes if they are spotted. As I said, Iron will remain at the assembly area, and I will call on the radio, and then they will dash forward at best speed to support the infantry. And Iron, remember, the enemy has handheld anti tank rockets and grenades, so don't let them get into stones throw distance of you try to always stick behind our own infantry and just host down suspected buildings with your weapons Copy that. all right commissar bias anything you wish to add i wish only for all of you to be saddened by the fact that you only have one life to give to the emperor besides that Excuse please me. um don't remove your protection systems or touch the tainted i will be excited to do my duties do we get bonus points if we bring heretics to you no okay please don't snitch on the other squads uh, yeah all right um squad leaders retribution one through four any questions
I take that as a no. Iron, any questions? We will purge them from this planet. Indeed. And finally, my Lord Astartius, anything you wish to ask? No questions. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, then. That hurt. In that case, um, see to your soldiers and pre prepare for battle. The Emperor protects. The Emperor protects. The Emperor protects. Oh, yeah. All right, moving out. Retribution one on point. I put incense. I'm a bit late, but I'm here. Incense, incense, Second. Incense, incense. I'm a bit of late, but I'm here. Yep. Oh, he's been captain. That does look glorious. Are we gonna blessing on the rifle first? Yeah, bless mm, my rifle. I bless you and your rifle with the back yeah. spirits that guide your path. I'm Beyond gonna go the fucking tear up some heretics. I'll be back. Please do. Don't remove the gas mask, please. Okay, if you, if you can send Retribution 3 to the worst assignments, you can. <laughs> we'll do our best. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck. Thank you. Yeah, so that's Alpha 2, the, the tall building on our front right. Mm -hmm. I see you. Which is very nice for navigation. Same with the other. We're gonna stick to the left of him, we should be fine. Yep. Now let's wonder to the rest of them and their escape on navigation as you are. Man, be advised, uh, noted a enemy sitting on top of the rooftop of Bravo 3 potentially. Um, it's the large, giant black building off in the corner. Copy last, that's Beta 3. You can check the alphabets at the west side of the map. Serious range just said command over the net, nothing else. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Well. Send your message. Good copy. Thank you. We'll inform us the situation progress. Send out. Got it report. Where are we taking fire from? It seems to be a boat or marine. Retribution boat. 1 is in contact uh, at Alpha 4, taking fire from Alpha 7. Copy. Iron. Drive to crossroads between Alpha 3 and Alpha 4.
All squad, squads advance according to plan. Enemy resistance at Alpha 7. We'll just cross them on our way to the manufacturer. See where we are. Prime absolute compass. Alright, I think we are on MSR Primus at the extreme west edge here. Mm, makes sense. Retribution no, 3 no, reporting no. enemy contact in the form of Space Marine through the northeast of our position at Alpha 4, here. possible location at Alpha 7. MSP has been set up at Alpha 2, I'm getting up onto the rooftop to try to give you more uh, Confirm, possible heretic car start is at Alpha 7. Retribution 1, this is 10. Have you crossed into Alpha 6? Retribution 1 has crossed the road. Copy. Retribution 2 is stuck here between Alpha uh, 4 and Alpha 6. There's enemy space marines due north of us. We cannot cross at this time. Alabaster, Retribution. We need you to move north. Prepare to engage enemy authorities at Alpha 7. How copy? Sounds good. Iron, push north along the road until you get eyes on Alpha 7. We need to suppress those heretics. Iron at Alpha 4, west, road. Moving due north, northeast. This is Retribution 1. Uh, look for the blown up building with a red star. That is where the Astartes and the infantry are present at this time. Retribution 1 copies. Retribution 1 is at Alpha 6 right now. Copy, Retribution 2, I need you to follow 1 and cross the road. Roger. We're being asked to push across the road east to our final point here. Let's get some smoke grenades out on this road. I know we've got a couple. Gotta get more. It's Retribution 1, enemies at Manufacturing Primus on Hangar 2. Reveille, on the multi-story uh, rock building to the north of the element, they are firing on the rooftops, at least the squad size is occupying that building. Copy. Retribution 2 made it across. We've taken significant casualties. Uh, we've got at least two people Is down at this time, but yes. um, we are prepped to continue pushing with Retribution 1 as best we can. That's affirmative. Continue pushing. Retribution's 3 and 4. Support Alabaster. An iron, we need to eliminate the hostiles at half seven. All possible means. Attribution three copies moving north towards half seven. All right, let's cross the road. Yeah. Alabaster, 
Alternative fire will be advised engaging enemy marines sporadic. Over. We are now at F6, east facing side, of course, west facing side. Send. Okay, general engagement with enemy marines towards Alpha 7 and the Sartertius. Over. Good copy. We'll try to flank that position from Alpha 6 with retributions 3 and 4. Let's go in to the open. Reveille eyes on contact. Start Fire team to squad size element Bravo 4, or Beta 4. On the first copy. Three is currently getting pinned down. We're on the western edge of Alpha 7, uh, unable to push up towards the center of the compound currently. This is Retribution 4. Retribution 4 squad leader currently down. He's being treated. We are defending this position uh, at the time being. Specify this position. I'm sure of map 50 meters. Guys, start rear. pushing east, it's just fine. Get some spacing. Okay, keep it going. I'm gonna start working on this fight. Retribution 3, I need you to start pushing east, get some spacing, and uh, spread your guys along. I'm sorry, so to spacing north. Retribution 3 copies, do you want us to be on MSR secondaries uh, facing north or on the alpha use the compound? Use the buildings, spread out, try to get ice north. Copy on last, no attempt. Uh, currently down to half strength, we'll possibly get wiped from this, no attempt. It should be fine, we got two squads in front of you, it's not too hot. Copy that. Go actual, get that uh, MSP ready to go. MSP is ready to play at Alpha 2. Iron sent. Iron at Alpha 4 Northwest on the roundabout facing north. No contact at this time. Over. Can I direct Iron to a good position to engage that contact on Bravo yeah, 4? Iron, this is Cog Actual. Advise There's you head Marines to Alpha 3 the towards the intersection and look down the length of the road towards Bravo Corner 4. The There's a squad size Probably. element on top of that roof. More than one, actually. This is Al, uh, Retribution 2. I'm back up. I've taken more casualties here. Alabaster, Retribution, message. I'm up, I can treat myself. Yep. Retribution 3 reporting, we'll manage to push the southeastern pack of uh, Alpha 7. Oh, wait, wait. You're good. I'm going to go. Excellent work. Under heavy contact, be advised, enemies are firing from, I believe, the townhouse or one of the larger buildings to the north uh, from elevated positions. Echo 2. Copy last, that is Epsilon 2. Retribution 2 for Retribution 10, we are taking significant casualties here. I, it's an untenable position. Watch your post, I assume, Alpha 6, east facing side. Essentially, we're stuck uh, between the roads here, uh, between Alpha 6 and uh, uh, the other portion of Alpha 6. Retribution 1, back on line. Retribution 3, back on line. Retribution 1, what is your current position? 
Resolution 1 is in its entirety at the respawn point. Copy. Move to Alpha 5. Prepare to advance along the river line. Break. Iron. Red Beacon 10. What is your position? He's currently on Secundus. All right, well, we need... right Iron is currently west of uh, Bravo 1. Red Beacon 2. Northeast of um, Alpha 6. Near Hangar 2. Enemy Space Marines are congregating there. Uh, you want to come with me for a second? You can get a better eye yeah. on the battlefield. Good copy, Red Beacon 2. Red Beacon 4. What is your position? I believe if you can hear me. I'm currently just around Hangar 1 and 2 with the rest of the men. We managed to set up a perimeter around Hangar 1 and 2. Excellent work. To all remnant units around Hangar 1 and 2, we got a congregation of enemies approaching okay. from the northeast. So, Get ready um, for combat. This way. That building right there that I'm pointing to right now had a fire team on it. They were hit. They're still in that building. There's yeah. a fire team there. That is Echo 2. They are hitting the northern side of your element. That building right there is also occupied by a squad size element that is on the roof. They are hitting, I believe that's Bravo 2, on your eastern side at Alpha 6. Yeah, well, that's... Uh, there's... We, what's what's up with Iron? Why are they not under... Do... Um, Iron is trying to engage, but they just have, I guess, poor sight lines. I'm trying to pull them back here, because if they get right there on that road, yeah, they that's... can shoot into beta. Yeah, that's what we want, but they're not under radio. Thomas Tower reporting enemy concentration around... Uh, one second. Delta 4 and Epsilon 1. Iron, Good iron. copy. This is Pog actual. Red push of one is at Alpha 5. Requesting permission to iron. continue along the river bed. Affirmative. Continue. Friendly is currently engaged around Hangar 1. Break. Copy. Alpha 6 should be clear of hostiles at this time. Stand by. We're trying to find you. I guess they're actually... Iron's in the shit right over there. Alright, well, if they're, they're doing the something... Pod. Yeah, if they're doing something, that's good. Copy. Be advised, there's an enemy squad on the Bravo 2 marker to your direct east. Yeah. Red Beacon 1, be advised, we can observe hostile squad on Bravo 2. Okay, well, we lost one vehicle. Retribution 1, copy, is Bravo 2. Retribution 3 has reached Alpha 7 again, we're currently pushing eastbound. Iron Tech Priest. Be advised, hostiles to your north, Epsilon 1, Delta 4, you won't be able to cross the rail rails, break. Get to northeast corner of Alpha 7, try to get eyes towards Delta 4, see if you draw fire. Mm. Alpha 3 copies lost. The machine spirits were happy, they decided to attack the heretics. Indeed. Commissar, how's it looking at Hangar 1? Um, currently in the back end of Hangar 1, it's clear, but the rail yard uh, to the north of it is being overlooked by enemies on uh, Delta 4. Copy. I see them poking their heretic heads out. Yeah. Do you think it would be possible... Do you have a squad there that we could use to assault Bravo 1? I'm not in position. Uh, I'm currently west of Hangar 1, but I could move to Bravo 1. The Marines one are around is, Bravo uh, 1. Relinked at this time with our um, reinforcements. We are on the edge of Alpha 6, prepped to push across whenever uh, stated Commissar or Commander, whoever's up. This is Retribution 10. Start pushing towards Bravo 1. The advice Retribution 1 on your south flank. I repeat, friendlies to your south on the river line. And on Hangar 1 to your north. Send. Enemy vehicle approaches north of Delta 4. Over. Thank you. Enemy vehicle north of Delta 4. Alabaster, what is your position? Alabaster is currently at Bravo 3. Holding. Over. Bravo 3. Excellent work. Hold the position. Wait until you are relieved. Red Beacon 2. Be advised. Friendlies at Bravo 3. Move immediately to manufacturing primus. Clear the large buildings. I got Red Copy Friendlies just at Bravo on... 2. Move immediately to manufacturing facility. Understood. 
I got uh, Retribution 3 with me here. We are east of MSR Tertius. We are overlooking uh, the open row yard. Want us to stay here? Can you see hostiles to your north at Delta 4? Uh, yeah, they're engaging. Pod they're drawing pods at each other. Yeah, that's good. We need to tie the enemy down so that we can take the Manufactorum. Oh, yeah. That's a long range radio backpack on top. I saw one. Uh, Cock Axel, now would be the time to do the ammo around to hangar one. Got it. And I'll come along. Oh, wonderful. There is a commander seat for you, so. Don't get shot out of it. Are you going to dismount there? Yes. I did not hear you, by the way. Yes. Around here, yeah. I'll uh, return back here and put the MSP down here because it's honestly not. Doors are not bad opening on the manufacturer arm. This is Retribution 2. We are here at this time, but we cannot get them open. Uh, that's fine. Push north. Take control of Bravo 3 if possible. Take control of Bravo 3. Understood. Let's go. That's a nice effect. From Retribution 4, Second in Command, enemy vehicle between Echo 1, Delta 4. Correction, Epsilon 1, Delta 4. Copy. Our grenade launchers and plasma rifles should be able to do some damage to it. Retribution 4, what is your position? Retribution 1 is at Bravo 4. Copy. Are you in contact? Negative. No contact. Copy. Move north. Take control of Bravo 5. Retribution 1 moves to Bravo 5. Copy. So either... T Be advised. Seems like enemies are right. on the building east of Epsilon 1. Copy. That is... I saw. Enemy infantry. Echo 4 roof. I saw. Epsilon 4, four roof, that is the townhouse. This is uh, Retribution 2. We have taken a building just to the um, north of the Manufactorum near Bravo 3. We are having to heal. Um, as soon as we're done, we'll be able to move on. Uh, what orders are we, do we have? We need to move north. To Delta 2 and then start pushing west towards the correction. Delta 2 then Delta 4. Understood. Affirmative. Retribution 1, same order. If you are not in contact, move north, clear Delta 2 and Delta 4. Retribution 1 copies. Uh, Bravo 4, Bravo 5, no contact and both are not enterable. Moving to Delta 2. Ammo's been dropped, I'm out. Copy. Just run around and see if there's any people who actually need the ammunition. Gotcha. Heretics and Delta 4. Copy last. Uh, my lord, I ask that you preserve Alabaster for now in reserve until we can identify new parties asking for you at, at this time. Do not get sucked into attritional fighting. Very well. Bias, status. With Retribution 3, you're keeping them in uh, line. Command, they haven't taken casualties, but we're pissing off the enemy. Two. Be advised. Um, One of their vehicles was destroyed. We could do with uh, some armor supply. Mostly get medical. Our uh, medic is at, at about third of his uh, total. Okay, what is your position? Identify a chimera. Repeating last transmission, we destroyed a chimera and we're holding position. Copy. Red Beacon 2, repeat your position immediately. Repeat last. Mm. What, can I do? what is your position of the resupply? Uh, we are just north of Bravo 3, moving towards Delta 2 at this time. I don't want to take the priest, the water. Tech priest. Send. Uh, do you have a resupply position set up? Yes, it is behind the firehouse. Unable to provide supply Perfect. that far forward. We are currently at Hangar 1 and we need the vehicle for MSP shortly. 
Me too. Oh, correction. Cog actual. Get this uh, bad boy set up and check what our timer is. Copy. Stand by. I'm treating a space marine at the moment. Copy. Direct vision sent to all units. We are currently advancing north side manufacturer, clearing Delta area. Break. Two squads, press Alabaster and currently exchanging fire with the hostiles in Epsilon area. Once we have resupplied, we'll start making our egress into Epsilon 1. Retribution time for Retribution 3, interrogative. Uh, do we have any resupply locations already set up? Uh, the, the boys at Delta se uh, Alpha 7 are currently low on ammo. Affirmative. At the back of Hangar 1, we currently have ammunition available. Copy on Retribution 1 to Retribution 10, Delta 3 possible enemy contact, only gun sounds right now. Retribution asking, are there any friendly elements at Delta Re? This is De uh, Retribution 2, we are at Delta 2, Delta 2 at this time, we have enemy elements to our northwest, uh, Retribution 1. Copy, uh, are there enemy elements at Delta 5? I believe that is their location. It's either Delta 3 or Delta 5. Push on one copy, so. Copy. This is 10. We are not moving that far north. We just need to take control of Delta 2 and Delta 4. We are not pushing any further north than that. Please treat my lord. What? Thank you. I need you to fix the lord. What are the heavy last pieces? Oh, yeah. The go actual, I need update on the tree spawn, we should be waiting in the way. Uh, had to leave for a moment. Any updates? One for command. We've captured Delta 2, yeah. uh, we're moving through Delta 2 to Delta 3 and then Delta 5. Negative, don't go Delta 4, Delta 3, move to Delta 4 instead, we are not moving north. Copy. Uh, we have voices close to our northwest in Delta 3, Delta 5, along with a vehicle coming down a road. Copy, uh, in that case. Not marked. Hold your position in that case for now, you will screen the movement of the rest of the force. Two minutes. Three, this is ten. Are you combat effective? My lord, if you require more ammunition... Uh, with us for retribution three. Affirmative. Are you combat effective at this time? Mm -hmm. Hey, firm, just done resupply of our good move. Copy. I need you to take control for Delta 4. Yeah. Recommend you assault through Beta 3 if possible. Copy on last. We'll start swinging back around currently at Alpha 7. We'll do a fish hook at, uh, towards the south and then try to move from uh, Bravo 3. Alabaster is your current commander here. This is Red to Push 1, Delta 3 enemy vehicle. Rest, uh, red 1 is pushing to Delta 3 from north of Delta 1. Delta push on 10, Hong Kong. Oh, thank you. Well, Copy last. Never, any doubt. never at all, my lord. Go, actual, what's our time on the re respawn wave? One minute, a little bit less. Excellent. Uh, after that, uh, I'll pack up the MSP, head back, grab more ammunition, come back. Yes, sounds yeah, excellent. We have a lot of stamina. We can just ammunition if you need it. Ammunition. No, they are. They have their orders. They need to move. Retribution oh, okay. uh, four. This is ten. What is your position status? Retribution four is uh, on the northeastern corner, Alpha seven. Copy. Are you still in contact to Epsilon area? Uh, the contact data died out just. This is Retribution two. We have enemy Space Marines, enemy vehicle, and the corner of Delta 5. Uh, they seem to be bringing in reinforcements to that location and pushing southwest. Copy. Hold your current position and get ready to receive them. We are sending you reinforcements. Copy. Need resupply as well. I know it's going to be difficult to get us here. We are on the northwest corner of Delta 2. Alright, look, actual. Uh, Once the respawn okay. comes in, Take this ammo box and leave this with Retribution uh, with 2. Retribution 4, do you want them moving or do you want them staying here? They're currently engaging contacts. Two. We need them moving, we need to take control of Delta 4 if we want to get anywhere. 
Retribution 4 would need to go through the open if they wanted to do that. No, take and swing around. This is Retribution 1, we are in contact okay. with fucking zombies at Delta 3. Respawn's already gone off. Alabaster. Retribution 10, urgent. Sure. My lord, we, re we request you at Delta 3 at best possible speed. We are being assaulted by some type of monstrosities. Break. Also, Heretic has started, spotted around Delta 5. Well. Retribution okay. 2, be advised, we are bringing the ammunition to you now. Roger. Nail the two, northwest corner. A heavy contact still to our northwest, um, including Space Marine fire. Nail the two, northwest. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Understood. I'm on the way. We're digging and holding here, though. I'm moving Retribution 4 to try to help with Delta 4. Seems like we need everyone there. Yeah. I mean, we need to take control of that to advance on the next objective. Iron. Understood. Okay. Everyone's going there. Good copy. Iron. Relocate to Delta 2 at best possible speed. Break. Heavy enemy contact at Delta 5 at this time. Request your support. This is Retribution 1, uh, the monstrosities have stopped for now, we are north of Delta 3. 1, report last known position of Heretic Astartes. Uh, say again. Report last spotted position of enemy Space Marines. Uh, Retribution 2 saw them last. Last known location was Delta 5 uh, along the, sorry, the northeast corner of Delta 5, uh, opposite of Delta 6. Copy. Retribution 1, move towards that location, make contact with the enemy so Alabaster can assault. Retribution 2 here is holding the south side of Delta 3 and the northwest corner of Delta 2. We've got the MSR locked down. All right. Let's uh, get somewhere else. Two, this is COG Actual. Ammo has been dropped just to your southeast in Delta 2. Roger. Appreciate it. Ooh. I'm on the way back to spawn, grabbing an ammo crate, and uh, we'll re-put down the... Uh, actually, do you want me to go put down the uh, respawn up here in Delta 2? I can get up into a clear spot here. Uh, we need to ammo first. We should have time. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm doubling back for the ammo, but when I come back, uh, I can probably get back up into Delta 2. And Red to push the 1 to Red to push and down, requesting permission to continue to Delta 5. Granted. Go ahead. It's probably too close to the enemy at this time. I should. I will return back to the hangar. Uh, Red to push 1 is contact with enemy mutants once again. Retribution 2 for Retribution 10. We're taking significant casualties at this time. Uh, we're getting pushed heavily from our north and our west. Uh, Copy. Should have friendlies to your immediate north, as far as I know. They're between the two of us. They're between our elements. Alabaster requesting us you clear hostiles between Delta 2 and Delta 3. Retribution 3 has reached the northern edge of Delta 4, unknown if we're taking contacts with friendly units itself. Copy. Establish presence on the north and west facing sides and wait for the rest of the force to catch up. Copy on last. We'll try to avoid the south side since we don't want to fire back on friendlies if uh, those are friendly cars. Somehow I haven't died yet, but my lag is gone. Retribution 4, we have objective to take and planet to conquer. Get your ass moving north now.
Iron Recognition. Can you get eyes on to Epsilon 2 and Epsilon 4? Those are large black buildings, enemies using them to suppress us. This is Iron, suppressing towards uh, Epsilon 2, over. Yeah, Thank you. Excellent. Distribution, Iron. Send. Interrogative. How far are friendly forces in the Delta area? Over. Delta 4, west facing side. Retribution 10, Retribution 3. We're going to be moving north from Delta 4. I think we'll still take it uh, friendly fire. I'm going to move to Delta 5 on the southwestern edge. Copy. 1. What is your position? Alabaster, Recognition. Do you read me? Alabaster reads you. Send your message. What is your current position and status? Alabaster is Delta 6, engaging traitors in the road next to us. Over. Good copy, last. 3. Be advised. Alabaster at Delta 6 to your north. Retribution 1 currently unknown. They were assaulting Delta 5, but we lost comms. Retribution 3, copy last. We have uh, Space Marine to the southeast of us. Southeast, that makes Cancel no sense. Cancel last, uh, Miss PID on friendlies. Also, a significant amount of gunfire coming in from the big black building to our southwest. Copy, that Epsilon is one. Epsilon true. We are trying to suppress. Epsilon chooses to be the center of their firepower. We can move around it. Yeah, I mean, we need to um, get to the crown level and then we can assault and clear that building. Yeah, Such is life. I am back in with new ammunition MSP as a hangar one. What's our timer? Stand by. Six forty. Uh. Never mind. Where do you think we are? Um, I imagine this is retribution ten, two for two. ten. Send. There's a road that ends here. We are moving along the edge of Delta Three uh, towards the crossroads there's, to try and relink with uh, friendly troops that yeah, just got good. blown up. Copy. So we have castled this. That's not good. Retribution iron. Iron sent. Be advised, we took damage, left track broken, hull damaged, we'll repair, rearm, refit afterwards. Over. Good, copy. Out. Retribution, Iron. Be advised, we suppress those targets towards uh, due west from Bravo 5, Delta 2, towards e Epsilon 2 or 3. The tall building with enemy infantry. Over. Affirmed if that's Epsilon 2 most likely. Oop. Yes, anyway, there's something weird going on on our north flank. People just go there and we lost all comms, but... Uh, retribution 1 to Retribution 10. 1, send your message. <sighs> retribution 1 is at Delta 6. We are taking fire from across the park. Requesting permission to relocate to south. That's affirmed if that's our plan. Have, do you have eyes on Alabaster at your position? Retribution uh, 2 for Retribution 10. 2, send. I've got Alabaster actual down on my position. Uh, we are break currently occupying southwest corner, Delta 3. Over. Copy. Can you help him? A firm. Medic's working him right now. Uh, be advised, we got a bit of a bit of a mass cas at this position now. Over. Copy. Report once your squad is mobile. Out. Copy out. Yeah, we're, we're basically right. Retribution mm -hmm. 1 is rec uh, reporting an enemy vehicle at the park. Copy. Only infantry small arms available at this time. Iron is uh, rearming. Break. 4, 10. What is your position? Uh, four. 
4 to 10. We have moved maybe 100 meters to your west in D4. Copy. We need you to start pushing to Epsilon 1 area so we can get some ground here. Roger, we keep pushing west to Epsilon 1. Affirmative. Would you like me to reposition the MSP to east side of Delta 2 or Delta 1? It is currently back at the hangar. Enemy fire team, Epsilon 4. Yeah, sounds good. Understood. One, relocate south, report once in Delta 4, and, and get ready to push further west with Retribution 4. Soldier! You're good here. <laughs> yep. Uh, we'll stay here for now. We know that we could one squad in front of us. No point getting too exposed here. So anything in north of us should now be clear. So enemies probably concentrating on, around the townhouse for now. Next task for us will be the clearing Epsilon 2. That will give us elevation and we can leave one squad there to suppress the townhouse while we uh, make our next move. Which squad do you want to be sitting there? It depends who gets there alive. <laughs> Got it. You gonna leave one on Delta, uh, on, uh, Delta 6 or you're just going to move everyone to Epsilon? One squad, Delta 6 is probably a good idea. That's probably gonna be Retribution 2. They are currently healing at the rear lines. And one. Retribution 10, Retribution 2. Send. All casualties have been worked. Uh, we are good to go. Occupying southwest corner Delta 3 time now. Copy. 2. I need you to establish presence around Delta 5, Delta 6, facing west. To draw the enemy fire. The rest of the force will push down south. How copy? We are going to suppress Delta 5, Delta 6 to draw attention from Delta 3. Negative. Move to Delta 6, Delta 5, west passing copy. side. Engage across the park. Tight the enemy there so we can advance along south. Copy. Be advised the, uh, the terrain uh, map and the terrain are outdated. We got nothing but wide open fields to this location. We're going to likely have to push farther north to get around this. Over. Copy. As long as you stay with the allotted area. Out. Um, Cog Actual, repeat time on MSP. 1.30. Copy. I'm expecting at least most of Retribution 3 to spawn there. Copy. I am just east of Delta 3. Uh, I have eyes on, I believe, Retribution 2 and the other Retribution element here to the west of me. I will send them to that direction. I'm not seeing the MSP on map. Is it deployed? Uh, yes, it is deployed. Uh, yes. Okay. See you on Nelon and Tayaris. Oh, great. One second, I'll get him. Alabaster, Retribution Medic. 2, we've got Space Medic. Marine spotted west across the park, approximately Medic. 100 Medic. meters, over. Oh. Yeah, you guys start moving, we'll uh, deal with this guy. I'm doing CPR. You yep. guys can go. Yep, yeah, so... just start moving. Okay. You should live. 10 seconds to respawn. Four, ten, can you report, report contact? He's gonna make it. Yep. Friend, friend over there. South. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, we're back up. They did not spawn on the MSP. That sounds not fun. Yeah, it's deployed and everything. Very cool. Uh, teleport back to base. He'll attempt to use the teleporting system instead.
Copy. Uh, this is Retribution 2. We're back online. Uh, we are leaving out of main base and heading back up. What are the orders given at this time? Orders are to use teleport testing technology. Teleport your MSP if possible. Break. Retribution 2 standing orders are to be at Delta 5, engage the enemy across the park, tie them down to enable the rest of the force to assault through south. Understood. Uh, we're working on that now with the remaining folks in the field. Retribution 3 just respawned back at the main base. We're currently walking back. We still have some remnants currently at D6 holding a position. Copy. 3, see if you can use the teleportation to move to MSP faster. In any case, move to Delta 4, get ready to assault west towards Epsilon 2. Be advised, Retribution 10, the MSP does not seem to be functioning at this time. Copy, in that case you'll have to walk. I'll see what's up with it. Retribution lead, Iron, over. Iron sent. Be advised, about 4 minutes plus transit time for, for us to return to the battlefield, over. Are you at base? Can you provide transport? We are at base repairing the vehicle at this time, over. Uh, copy, in that case let the guys work. Flash Retribution 1 has enemy contact at Echo 1, Echo 2 in the big black building, there's enemy. Copy last, we are aware. Yeah. Top of the townhouse, there's enemies as well. Reporting the same thing. Yeah. We are currently trying to gain ground in the Epsilon area so that we can send an assault team to Eps clear Epsilon 2 later. 4, this is 10, are you still on this net? Four, we have respawned most of the squad. They're moving up. Copy. How far did you make, and what was contact in Epsilon area? Uh, we we we're about to cross over to the Epsilon 1 area, and then smoke and that for everybody. Copy. Alabaster. Alabaster, send. Alabaster is still full strength and ready to move. Delta 6, we are engaging contact west at Echo 4 area. Alabaster, relocate to Delta 4, get ready to perform a lightning assault to clear Epsilon 2. It's a troll back building that is hindering our advance. We have friendlies in front of you. How copy? Hello, Ambassador, do you copy last transmission? Over. They are probably just processing. I hope. Yeah. I put back up the MSP. It's farther to the east in Delta 1. I have no notifications okay. about it getting overwhelmed or anything like that. Retribution so. 1, last message. We are storming at Epsilon 2. Oh, we got friendlies. Out. Excellent yes, job. Emperor, bless your attribution 1. Excellent. Alabaster. I need you to relocate to Epsilon 2 at best possible speed. Friendly is currently assaulting Epsilon 2. Unsure if they are successful. I need you to reinforce that assault. Sweet. God, they're fast. Yep. Retribution 1 is killing the enemies with the chainsaws. We are storming Epsilon 2. Five or not, nah, I just heard one of them get shot. Anyway, but that's excellent. Once we can take position of that, we can start suppressing the town house more effectively. And we can. Come, come, Reveille, come back. Reveille, come back. This hostile's up Enemy front. Enemy space marine spotted. Back. Echo 5 at the intersection heading south. I'm not going to make over. a fire 5 of a squad, just the two of us. Enemy space marine Where spotted. This is Retribution 2. Echo road. 5 west. headed south to Echo Copy. Copy last. Alabaster is currently otherwise engaged. Yeah, I mean, see them if you see them. Uh, no, they're not there anymore. They're moving to the buildings. Those buildings? Alright, so that is. Just north of Epsilon 2, I think. Epsilon. Yeah, that or further back. Yeah, around there. No, uh, yeah, I think it's a closer one because we're right here. Okay. Well, let's 
big position here. If we see them moving, we'll start opening fire. If we can pin them down, that will contribute to... They're making some good ground clearing through Echo 2. No problem. That is excellent news for us. Yeah, I think they're on the second and top level. Is over. Iron sent. Iron is Oscar Mike towards Malmazar Primus North, 150 meters. Over. Copy. Relocate to Delta 4 North. 50 meters, get ready to engage the enemies across the park. Interrogative, do you want us to go between Delta 4, Delta 5, and uh, main road, over? Affirmative. We get hostiles on Echo Epsilon 1, north facing buildings, Echo 3, north facing buildings, and the townhouse. The Emperor protects. Iron Cog Actual, you have good sight lines in between Delta 2 and Delta 3 mark. Only the hostiles have those, like, missile launchers, right? Yes. Yeah, then it was them for sure. Eight minutes for respawn. Yep. Do you need me doing anything else or staying here? I will be staying here. Naked. Retribution 3 reporting. I managed to link up with the remnants currently back at uh, Delta 6. Repetition 3, I need you to relocate south to Delta 4 and 10 onward to Epsilon 2. How copy? 3 copy last. Cog Axel, I need you to make way to Delta 6, Delta 5, establish what is the position and status of the Retribution 2 and see if they need ammunition. Copy and ship. We'll head back to Delta 1 uh, before respawn timer starts. Honestly, there's a lot of foliage in that park. You could move in really Unless I can place it down there. You. No, but if they're in the town house, they can get elevation and they can see yeah, you. Yeah, they can see through you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not good. That's a chew, man. We could do it, but that's dumb. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alabaster, Retribution 10. Is Epsilon 2 secured? Copy. I trust you to destroy them. Emperor, protect you. Friendly is coming in. She's fire. Hostiles are moving in yep. during those buildings again. Retribution 3. If you start pushing direct west, we get hostiles in the north facing buildings of Epsilon 1. Alabaster is in there as well. I saw a marine moving yep. through the Three walls. has reached the northeastern side of E1, regroup with friendly space marine, engaging contact to the west whenever they become uh, visible. Oh, Copy. <laughs> that marine not having a good time. Iron, retribution, urgent. We need suppressive fire on the townhouse. I'll copy. Yeah. Well, it's the biggest building on the map. I'm sure that we can see it eventually. Go actual report once you have found retribution to and assist their status. Copy should be at Delta 6 now. Retribution Iron. Send. Iron, uh, suppressing the townhouse door. Copy, taking heavy fire with that position. Keep the guns hot. Rebel, you got hostile space rings down the road. West. Urgent, iron, hostile space marines west along the road that you are currently facing. West. I repeat, hostile space marines at the park right now. South of the park, south of the park, the road south of the park. Currently with the two. They're calling on contact west in a grocery store near MSR Quatas at this time. They sent out a recce team, they're trying to go and figure it out, but they are uh, trying to make ground. I'm yeah, also going to need but to push back are they in context? I need them to tie up the enemy so that we can push the main effort down south.
This is Retribution 2 for 10. Send. Uh, we have taken capture Delta 6. We're, we've moved across slightly uh, to the northeast corner of the park. Um, we have clear line of sight into Echo 5. Would you like us to move and capture that at this time? I need you to tight the enemy to distract them from the main effort. Use whatever means you deem appropriate. I'll copy. Copy. Distraction techniques unleashed. Understood. Would you like me to leave my ammo crate here and go back for respawn? Sorry. For respawn. Just resupply to and uh, keep the crate for now. Copy. And I'm heading back to set up MSP. One, Be ten. Are you on this Oh, I'm getting Position the kill the marine. Uh, we we are at Echo 2, tall back yeah. building, building and we're holding. Copy, how is your ammunition and casualty state? Currently unknown. Retribution 3, position and status. The rest of the enemy marines rushed him. Well, I think, well, we still got friendlies at Epsilon 2. I think this went pretty well. Retribution 4, this is 10. What is your position and status? Uh, Retribution 4, I'm trying to understand myself. I think we are the eastern part of Epsilon 3. Epsilon 3, excellent work. Are you in contact? Negative. But there's a uh, there big contact around us, sir. Command, Alvester. Sent. We are too strong with the guardsmen at our side. Would you have us push Echo 4 at the Great Tower? Two minutes on response. If you think that is possible, execute it. Saw somebody loot the dead space marine. Oh, Speed by his command. Enemy Excuse. space marines Excuse. are somewhere near the townhouse. Somewhere near the townhouse at this time. Revelation is going to cross the road and I'm going to go far. Yeah, I'll follow you. Retribution 3 has reached the edge of the. Oh, hold on. You want me to tell these guys to go to? Do their Same squads. Path, I think. Do their squads where they happen to be. Yep. Just to know if you had anything else. One, if a bull provides a pressy part to the townhouse from your current position. Send for 10. Retribution 4 has pushed up. We are close to the northwestern corner of Epsilon 3. Copy. Can you see any hostiles around the townhouse? Enemy forces is occupying townhouse. Copy. Keep engaging and suppressing them for now so that we can get another squad to push in further. We got friendlies, there's just up ahead. That's Retribution it. 10, this is Retribution 2. 2, sent. Be advised, we are providing a distraction here on the north side, uh, near Echo 5. Um, we are engaging about a squad size element along with one of their Taurus vehicles. Um, there are space marines up this direction as well. They seem to head further south towards Echo 3 or Echo 4. Good, copy.
Respawn wave once again didn't come here. They're within 500, I guess, from the east side of the At the northern edge of Echo 3. Yeah, I don't think the MSP currently deployed either. That might be the reason. Yeah. Uh, so they're within 500 meters of the east side of Delta 3. Yeah, we need to be more conservative with that. Let's uh, do bait, bait yeah. area next. Yep. I'm just going to start putting them down in bait areas because uh, this is starting to get funky. Uh, which squad is this? One. One? Ten? Are you on this net? One is back online. Half of my squad is at the respawn point. Half is at Echo 2. Did you receive uh, uh, Yeah, affirmative. I told them to go west because there was another squad in there. Copy. We are currently pro progressing west of Epsilon 2, trying to get egress on the townhouse. I'm just gonna keep it back here in Delta 1 until we cross the park. I can't fucking get it any closer. Uh, beta 3. Beta 3 might be viable or around the manufacturer. Uh, no, because it's too close to Echo 2 and Echo 3. Copy, those should be in friendly hands, hopefully. I hope so. Uh, 4 to 10. Send. Uh, this squad has been decimated. We are three men left. Copy. I assume that you are Epsilon 3 Northwest. Yeah, where the grenades are exploded. Iron, this is um, Retribution 2. We are immediate northwest of you, about 10 meters here, in and amongst the buildings. There's an enemy chimera further down towards your west, about 100 meters. Somebody's mad at you. Oh, that's north. Nope. North is clear. There's nobody in the park. I'm going to test okay. pro or the viability of that Bravo 3 marker you're talking about. Is Iron able to suppress the townhouse? They are currently dueling with the enemy vehicle. Okay. Send. We are three strong at Echo 3. Now four. Where do you have us? Epsilon 3 approach townhouse is too hot. Break. I need to swing back east. Move to Epsilon 5. Retribution 2 currently holding terror. Break. From Epsilon 5, if able, clear the buildings north of the townhouse to enable infantry assault. How copy? Is there a vehicle burning? No, it's on the other side of the park. Uh, it's enemy, I think. Thank God. I'll thank the Emperor. North of the park. I imagine it's enemy. Iron, be advised that uh, contact down the road has been dealt with. They're hammering us from fucking uh, the townhouse. Enemy need iron to fucking fire everything they have there. Have AG. Yeah, well, I don't know why those guys are pushing west. They should be heading northeast, but oh well. I'll go tell him move. Yeah. It's the sister who's laying up for the cube wagon. I repeat. Send. Enemies remain around the townhouse. There is no route. Echo 5. We are in danger. 
Station for three, Delta three, now over. Alabaster, I need you to swing northeast to Delta four, Delta five, Delta six. Use MSR quarters to get to Echo five from north. How copy? Two, ten, tell me you are still holding the Epsilon 5 area. We are, uh, we just took a mass cas, but we are still here. Copy, be advised, Alabaster will be filtering to your position in a few mics. Three, ten. There's only remnants of three here on, uh, Epsilon, th Epsilon th three. Copy, keep them engaged towards the townhouse. We need enemies to shoot, shoot something else when the Alabaster makes their move. Eight minutes for respawn. I'm gonna see if I can get it north towards Delta 4, unless there's a better spot that you want me in. Ah, uh, your current spot is fine. Understood. I told the Marines to head east and then swing around the park because they're not able to go straight north from here. Yeah, well, that's what I want him to do. I'm just not sure why. Yeah, he didn't understand you. Yeah. Which is why we need three to keep engaging the townhouse to distract the enemy's, enemy's fire. Three strain, three strain with okay. them right now. Iron, 10, what is your status? I think we uh, lost our vehicle. Probably. Try to get eyes on it. One, 10, are you on this net? Pusher one is at Delta six, almost. We got hostile space race. Copy. Alabaster, retribution one. Push west along MSR quarters. Friendlies at Echo five. Break. We are. Be, be advised, this is retribution two. The Chimera blew up ahead of us. Uh, we are still uh, near Echo five, engaging enemies. Uh, we just took a mass gas event, unfortunately. Uh, our tech priest did not bless our guns well enough, and one of them blew up. Copy. One alabaster. Push Epsilon 5 now, and try to get Icarus into the townhouse. Now is our best chance. Keep everybody firing towards the... Townhouse, as you can. The more flak we take here in south, means the guys in north have a better chance. They're getting hammered by marines, straight northwest. The townhouse and the marines all together is kind of keeping three pinned. Yeah, but that's fine. If they are shooting you, that means they are not shooting north. Oh yeah, I understand. I just telling you. Volumes, this is 10. We are currently suppressing hostiles, including marines at the townhouse from the south. Break. Retribution 1 and Alabaster are currently moving in north, trying to get Egress from that side. Yeah, we've got hostile armor as well. Yeah, copy. I took some flak from that, but I should survive. Bias, did you survive? I'm still alive. Everyone else here around me is dying. <laughs> 
Two, ten, talk to me. What is happening in the north? They were dealing with that mass chasm. One was coming up from their rear, trying to support them. This is this is retribution two message. Send. What's up? Send. Send. Retribution 2 got destroyed, trying to cross over MSR Cortez. We're down to three men. We're just uh, east of Echo 5. Copy. Do you have eyes on Retribution 1 or Alabaster? Uh, yeah, they're just to our west. We're just getting ourselves passed up and we'll push to them. Copy. Report to them where you lost your friendlies because we need to coordinate with them to be able to make push in the north side. Send. Copy. Would you advise that Alabaster moves to Kappa 1 instead then? Copy last. They're close to uh, Magic Victoria's Prime again. I'm gonna have to push it farther east. Yeah, dude. We're about two minutes out on that respawn. No joint, the MSP, you need to f keep moving further. Yep. By us. One, ten, status. Well, anything is better than walking from base, you know, Alpha 6, Alpha 5, yep. Alpha 4. I'm having to double back all the way. Yeah, they're gonna spawn. Retro Bush of on back online. Iron uh, is trying to get our Promethean reactor working, but uh... Florian, kick, kick on the engine, for fuck's sake. <coughs> Everything is fine, sir. Ten copies, all messages, stand by. 
Currently, we have to walk from the assembly area to the front. New respawn. Break. Respawn has been set. All squad leaders, please see if you could teleport to the respawn point to save some time. Respawn network is not functioning. It is not teleporting us at this time. Copy. In that case, we'll have to walk. Break. All squads, make your way from the assembly area into Delta 2, Delta 4. Report once in Delta area so we can formulate another plan of attack to the townhouse. I think this was pretty much an entire force wiped here. Alabaster, move to Delta 2. Stand by for further orders once the task force has organized. Be advised. Be advised, Retribution 10. Uh, Retribution 2 still has members on Echo 5. Enemies are not pushing past them at this time. They are holding firm. I believe we can move to Delta 5 and Delta, Delta 6 to relink with them if you wish. I assume your position is at the assembly area. Is that correct? Repeat, I'm sorry. Keep those guys up there to give us some intel what is happening at the front. Will do. They're moving far except at this time. By us, Reveille. Soft range. Okay, well, the commissar is down, and I'm out of blood and out of bandages, so I'm not gonna be able to sustain myself indefinitely here. Copy. Yeah, I'll try to move I'll try to move towards the delta area to catch the incoming respawn wave, but just FYI. Gotcha. Uh if you are like in the process of actually dying, just let me know and I'll fucking I'll hold the I have down. some time, I could turn against, but that okay. won't stop the pain. I should I mean, I can drive over to you and pick you up and try to help you out if I can. It's pretty hot here, considering that we have no friendly presence at the front line at this time. Yeah. I love the respawn. It's totally not fucking me over. Still do have ammunition as well, so I can drop it off somewhere. They're just crossing MSR Primus now. As in, uh, the entire element. Um, is Alabaster leader here? Right here. Be advised, command. This is Retribution 2. Relaying info from troops near the front. Wait, what? Enemies seem to still be clustered around Townhouse, Kilo 1, and the, uh, eastern side of Echo... Or, sorry. The western side of Echo 5. They Copy. are not pushing south this time. Copy. Stand by. Alright. Uh... Alright, my lord, uh, you've been to the north, you've seen the terrain. Um, the enemy is still defending the townhouse. Attacking from south through Epsilon 3 seems to be a no-go. Do you think it's possible to go either through the park or through the Epsilon 5? What, what is your recommendation here? The enemy will use the flank at the corner of Kappa 1 to ensure an assault from Epsilon 5 would not succeed without ample smoke. The cover at Epsilon 5 is not, and across the street, not I still recommend a southern push. Allow the space marines to smoke and beat. We can take it. This area at Echo 3 goes downhill. We can at least use the railing to throw smoke across and lead the charge. And it would have to be a charge. Yeah, I agree, but we cannot, like, the because the elevation we have to go through north from the corner to actually get in there, and we direct under. under rest push, I want to rest push. Road is pretty. Wait, one. Is useless, so it's basically from Epsilon 3 corner in the townhouse. Alright, we'll try that. Just keep your squad alive. I'll try to form the rest of the platoon of force with iron suppressing the townhouse. And we sent like at least one infantry squad first to draw the fire so that you guys can get some headway. The entrance to the townhouse is on the west side. Send for 10. Be advised, my guys are now taking contact. Uh, from Echo 5 and the townhouse onto their position. Um, we require orders at this time if we're to relink with them or if we're going to move with the unit. You will relink with them. Understood. This is 10 to all units. Situation as follows. Break. 
Enemy still defending the townhouse, and we we need to clear them out. Craig. Recommendation fr from the ground is that we still try to southern push Epsilon 5 is too hot since the enemy can shoot inflating fire from the north. So plan is as follows. Break. We will need iron ready to provide suppressive fire to the townhouse from the other side of the park. 10. Retributions 1, 3 and 4 will move into Epsilon area to engage with the townhouse and smoke the main road to enable Alabaster to cross. So, Retribution 1, move to Epsilon 2. Report once there. Over to you. Uh, Retribution 1, conscience. Dark and red. Black and red. Retribution 3, move to Epsilon 2. Report once there. This is Retribution 3, we are next to Epsilon 2 currently. Copy. Retribution 4, move to Epsilon 1. Report once there. Roger. Iron, what is your position and status? Retribution 1 is at Epsilon 2, continue to Epsilon 3 to smoke the road. Don't smoke yet, we don't have the rest of the force ready. But be around there and get ready to move on my order. Don't use the smokes yet, we need to save those. Retribution 1 copies. Iron, this is 10. Report immediately once you're on net. Has anybody seen our tank? Uh, I saw it pass by earlier going up to Delta area uh, on MSR Primus, but I haven't seen it. Yeah, oh. well, as I said, we uh, our tank is currently MIA. We are waiting for I, Iron I to be in position. Go ahead. I actually believe there's a way to reach in contact with an enemy yep. squad, CQB, and on location of the summit to go north. Is there? I thought it's like a solid wall. No, no, I mean, if you. I thought that it was impossible to get down the road. Not, uh, here, just at the edge here. Okay. There, well, there in that. Be, uh... All right. In that case, we since, if you think that's possible, we'll send you guys in first. Just use all the smokes available, and try to crack us. But don't do it yet. Just get around here. Iron, be advised on that. Suppressing on yeah. top of the town of the townhouse. Yeah. I got you patched up and gave you some blood. Excellent. Thank you very much. Copy last iron. I need you to stay alive and get ready to suppress the townhouse on my order once we launch the assault. Retribution 3 reporting, enemy contact on the northwestern edge of E3. They've taken the building on the uh, southeastern side. Copy. Of, uh, e I need to take Retribution 3 and clear that position immediately. Copy. Retribution 3 currently firing from Echo 2 uh, towards that position. We're currently half, uh, half strength. We're engaging. This is 10. Be advised, Retribution 4 will be taking the point of the assault. They will try to smoke south of the Tyne house and cross the road. So I repeat, 4 will be on point for this next assault. This is Retribution 2 for 10. 2, sent. We've relinked with friendlies um, west of Delta 6, uh, just east of Echo 5. We're engaging townhouse, providing as much cover fire as we can on that and the buildings to are there north. Enemies are taking multiple positions on rooftops and interior buildings. Uh, try and saturate as best you can interior uh, to, to kill the enemies. And uh, God bless the Emperor. Copy last. Suppress the enemies as best as you can from your position and try to draw their fire. Four, report once you once you are close enough to start the assault and I will order Iron to start moving forward. Then from three be advised, I'm seeing one times enemy squad moving out of the townhouse south to get to the edge of the map and try to assault E3 from the northwest. Bobby. Retribution, this is 
Iron, over. Iron sent. Be advised, we have sporadic enemy marine contact. Kilo 1 Southeast, Echo 5 North, over. Copy, engage if possible, but remain alive and get ready to suppress the townhouse once we start the assault. The enemy is counter assaulting Echo 3 from the west. At least a fire team, over. Copy last. Easy kill for us. Let's destroy them before we launch our assault. This is Red Bush 1 enemies at Epsilon 3. They are trying to assault us. Break! Enemy Marine Echo 4, South 100. I'm gonna have to take the MSP South again. They're pushing too half far. Um, I'm probably gonna have to go down towards Alpha 3. Copy. Retribution 10, Retribution 1, requesting permission to assault Epsilon 3. Yeah, apparently. Clear the position. Uh, 4 to 10. 4, sent. Pushed up as far as possible on the eastern side of Epsilon 3, but if possible, move the other squads in to Epsilon 3 to distract the enemy. Yeah, we are Perhaps. doing that now. Yeah, we have some enemies that is looking down on our route of advance. Yeah, that's affirmative. We are pushing in now. Iron, 10, focus fire on the townhouse now. I repeat, shift fire towards the townhouse. Alabaster, if you're not currently contributing, you can get to left. Epsilon 2 and suppress the enemies at the townhouse until we uh, until we need you to move. Correction, 22. Uh, do an ammunition run to Retribution 2. There should be burning a lot of ammunition. Copy, I'll do it after the respawn. Respawn is in 130. Send. Iron at Delta 6 Northwest Crossroads, facing due west, sporadic contact with enemy infantry and Marines. Copy. They're on top of the big building by the big radio mass thing. Just standard infantry. Copy. One, turn, where we're able to destroy the enemy, moving into Epsilon 3. Poultry fire northwest, uh, 250, I think. Four is pushing, four is pushing. Alabaster, get ready to move. We are crossing the road now. Retribution three back on that. Hey, I'm back up. Uh, space Marines ran over my position. This is on D3. Yeah, copy. Alabaster is ready to move. Copy, we are crossing the road now. Follow Retribution 4. Cross the road. Try to get south of Townhouse immediately. How many guys would respawn? Retribution uh, 2 is preparing counterfire as well at this time. They're heading north to Hangar 1 towards Echo 1 at this time. 
Uh, repeat last, Kog actual. Uh, about a squad in more size element. They are heading north to the railways. Copy. Where are you able to resupply? Retribution 2. Sorry, say again, last. If the response came in, find Retribution 2 and supply them with ammo, they should be burning a lot. Understood. Retribution 2, this is COG actual. Well. What is your current location? We are just east, I'm sorry, just west of Delta 6. Uh, right on the border of MSR Quartus. I should ammunition will be to your east in approximately two mics. Copy. You can bring it all the way up to our building here if you wish. Uh, this is Retribution 1. Half of my squad is at Echo 4. Ha ha other half is at the Break, break, break. Alabaster in Epsilon 3, 4. Alabaster in Townhouse. He's fire in Townhouse. Bless the Emperor. Can you see where the hostiles are? One recent year last. One, ten, please resend your last message. This is retribution one to retribution ten. Send your message. Uh, we are crossing road to e Echo Four. Copy. Townhouse is clear. Move on the buildings on the south side. Townhouse is taking fire from direct west. Solid copy, huh? Yes, you don't have to have a question with the Havot. Select channel. I'm a bit coming up on Havot. Fire, and this is Retribution 2. Iron, this is Retribution 2. Back on, uh, sword range, sorry. Retribution 10, this is Retribution 2. Send for 10. Please advise Iron that there are enemy in Kilo 1, and they do have anti-tank rockets that will kill him if he continues to push up without infantry support. Copy, they should be hearing this net, but I uh, will relay. This is Commissar, I'm approaching a uh, townhouse from the east. Uh, are you, where are you currently at, Reveille? I'm currently at Epsilon 2. Um, move yourself to the townhouse, give me an assessment. What is the situation there? Will do. Tech Priest, this is Echo uh, Retribution 2. Status check on that ammo. I'm coming to you now, just to your east. Copy. Appreciate you. 4, this is 10. Are you on this net? Alabaster, Retribution, what is your current status? Are you combat affected? I can give you reports that Retribution 3 is to the southeast of the townhouse. Uh, they were sitting at the barricades engaging contacts far. Engaging to which direction? They're engaging west northwest. Retribution, Iron. Iron, sent. Amos, uh, iron at Amasar Quartus, west, 50 meters between the uh, bus stations, facing west. Over. Copy. Be advised. Enemy anti-tank at Kappa 1. I repeat, enemy anti-tank at Kappa 1. Do not push any further west or you will be exposed. Enemy anti-tank at Kappa 1. Out. I've dropped the crate with two. I'm going to head back, Alabaster grab another crate. Dead. Retribution 1 is on the way to Echo 7. Excellent work, 1. 
Three, are you on this net? This is three, send. Push to townhouse, north facing buildings, get ice to Kappa 1. We have reports of enemy contact there. Three copies last on them. So establish ice on Kappa 1 over MSR quarters. See if you can draw the enemy's fire to reveal their position. Weather pusher 1 is in contact towards north, enemy vehicle on the road. Copy. Iron should be able to observe all the way down MSR quarters. Most marine elements are in center townhouse with the area of leadership. Uh, we're currently just sitting here. Three has reached the north side of the townhouse uh, compound. Currently getting eyes on cap of one. We'll update shortly if we uh, see contact. Copy. Two. This is ten. Are you mobile? You wait one of those marines? They were. Yeah, I'm with them. I can take over leadership because it's going to take like 15 minutes for them to come back. Two. I need you to move to Kappa 1. We got friendlies covering from the south, so I need you to make egress into Kappa 1. Copy. Kappa 1. We'll do so. We'll do rearming marines, at this just time. Once we're rearmed, we'll Thank move. You. I'll Should notify you the enemies. Time. Copy last. Well, there should be contacts to your direct west at around Echo 7. One is in Firefight. Understood. I got everyone doing that. Three, hold your current pause until Recubition 2 has rearmed. Then you will cover them as they move into Kappa 1. This is Retribution 3. We are rearmed, holding the buildings north of the townhouse, engaging contact at the southwestern edge of uh, Kilo 3. Good copy. Uh, Bias, do you think. Does. Would Iron have any angles of fire at the base of the townhouse? Retribution for 10. Or Retribution 2. Uh, for retribution I'll take 10. a look. 2, sent. Be advised, we are moving down Quartus towards. Kilo 1 will advise once we've reached that point and captured it. I'm gonna go to the ground floor look for a position to Good fire. Good copy. Friendly to immediate south of MSR quarters. Engaging to Kappa 3 at this time. This is push of 1. We have enemies west of Echo 7 and also had enemies at Kilo 3. Good copy 1. Maintain your presence at Echo 7 at this time, while we start clearing the north side of the road. Mm, there's not many good positions for iron to fire here at the ground level, and uh seems like the townhouse is being suppressed by enemy marines. Yeah, copy all last. I imagine they'll have to go further north, uh, south of Kilo 1 maybe. Yeah, but we'll have to wait for the infantry to go in first to see if there's no ambush waiting there. I'm here. <laughs> I don't see anything yet. Retropusher 1 is in contact with zombies once again at Echo 7. Copy last. Trust the Emperor and repel those monstrosities. Code Actual, Retribution, what is your position status? Uh, currently just southeast of the Manufactorum Primus, uh, heading up the road towards the Delta area, just seeing if I can get an MSP down. We are uh, five minutes on uh, respawn. Uh, what is status of our ammunition crates? Dropped one ammunition crate at two, came back to base, picked one up, currently have one still in the stock. Copy. Drop ammunition crate at Townhouse. West side and send it up the MSP. You should have time. West side of townhouse? I'm affirmative. At the main entrance. That's where it is easy to find. Understood. Uh, we'll try to double time it over there. As you can hear, we are using a lot of ammunition up front. Understood. Once you've struck the ammo, announce it on the platoon box net so people know where to get it. Retribution 1 is in contact towards Kilo 7. Enemy strong grenades.
Copy last one. Just hold that position. We are still clearing north side of the road at this time. Three, ten, talk to me. What are you seeing? Also, Bias, have you seen Retribution of 4 in the last 10 mics? Negative on that. Copy. I've seen Retribution 1, Retribution 3 in this area, not 4. Yeah. Retribution 2 for 10. 2, sent. Good progress on Kilo 1. Uh, we are clearing out the last of the buildings. What are our orders after Kilo 1 is taken? Move west and clear Kilo 3. Clearing Kilo 3 afterwards. Understood. Three. This is 10. Message. That's for three. What is your current ammunition and casualty status? Ammunition estimated to be around 50%. We're still good on that end. Casualties, uh, one uncon, rest are alive and good to go. Copy. We are bringing ammunition to the townhouse. Once you are free supplied, report in and I'll have you a new, for new tasking. Copy on loss. Give me an update whenever the, uh, the resupply is available. I'll send my guys and then we're going to get to move. Currently afterwards. dropping right now. Cog actual, all units resupply dropped outside of townhouse building. Specify, is that west or east side? West side of Echo 4. I'm doubling back just so that I can get the respawn up. Yep. Commissar's current position is east of MSR quarters at a crossroads. Middle of its length. Copy. What are you seeing? Zombies mostly. Alright, that's a lot of them. We've been engaging the past five mics. Now, our current plan is that we, I think we're gonna have two squads clear basically cap at five, establish presence there, and then we'll send the rest of the force along the road. Try to make eager scene to the headlock. Copy. We got friendlies at the crossroads of MSR Quintos. Seems like we're pushing up to Kilo 6 at this point. I copy, that's two. They are a bit further Kappa north. Than... 6, correction. Yeah, they are a bit further north than expected, but that's fine. That should be reason too. I'm uh, really cutting townhouse right now. 10, 3. Uh, done resupplying. You're currently working on the wounded again because we got ran over by the tech priest. Uh, available for task. Uh oh. I did not know I did that. Copy. Good. Move north, cross the road. 10. West, establish presence at Kilo 5 to enable assault into her block 17. Retribution 2 is to your north. Copy on last. We'll be at K5 in about 5 mics. Retribution Iron. Message over. Iron, sent. Be advised, enemy marines at Kilo 4, destroyed 1, over. Kappa 4, sorry, over. Good copy. What is your current position? Iron at Echo 5, northwest crossroads facing due west, engaging sporadic contact, marines and light infantry, over. Good copy, keep the road clear for now. 10 out. Seems like we have zombies all spread out in the line between uh, Kappa 4 and Kappa 7. Retribution 4 from Retribution Copy. 3. I currently got one Sporadic, on my, uh, uh, one of your guys with me. Do you need him anywhere? 4 is currently off comms, expecting him to be in inbound at the next respawn wave. Be advised, this is Retribution 2 for 10. 2, send message. We've taken and captured Kilo 3. Um, all of Kilo 3 is secure. Enemy presence likely in Kilo 4, and we have significant ev enemy presence up on Havelock 17 in T1, T2, and T3. Copy last, have any presence in Tsao area as expected. Break. 2. Be advised, Retribution 3 is moving through you to assault Kilo 5. I want you to follow them and 
take control of Killer 5 together. How copy? Repeat last, please. 3 is on its way to assault Kilo 5 from your current position. Break. I need you to follow and assist Retribution 3 taking control of Kilo 5. And then you will be in a firefight to the enemy on the half block. How copy? Understood. Waiting for 3's arrival. We have Retribution. We have... Iron. Iron. We have fire coming in from Beta 6. One more Marine at Kilo 4 facing, moving towards north. No contact at this time. Over. Good copy. Any Marine? Revely respawns have just spawned in. Some of them are getting teleported up to Delta 4. Another squad has decided to walk all the way back from base uh, up towards townhouse. Copy. That's their cho choice. Four. Send message. Four have uh, reappeared. That's a four. Copy. Regroup at Epsilon 6. Report once there. Over. Regrouping at Epsilon 6. One, ten, status report. This is one. We are at Echo 7 in contact with enemy heretic marines. Enemies have Kilo 3 possibly. Uh, strength half a squad. Copy that. Two, can you confirm? Do we have hostiles at Kappa 3 at this time? We do not have enemies at Kilo 3, Kappa 3. Kappa 3 is clear. Enemies are in Kilo 5, Kilo 4, Tango 2, and Tango 3. Copy last. Two, use that. Last orders remain. Wait for three and send assault Kappa 5. Out. Uh, this is two for ten. There is a Torok up on the road between Tango 1 and Tango 2 that will prevent us from crossing into Kilo 4 and Kilo 5 unless it's dealt with. Copy. Advice. Where would we be able to engage that with Iron? Likely from MSR Quintus to the north of Kilo 3. Unknown if enemy presence in Kilo 6 or Kilo 2, however. Copy. In that case, that is your task. Move north. Clear Quintus for Iron to destroy the enemy vehicle. Uh, break, break. Be advised. Enemy Space Marines coming from the uh, Tango 1 or Tau 1 marker heading towards Kilo 4 this time. Bias, did you survive? Retribution 10, Retribution 1. 10, send. Requesting any orders. One, would you be able to cross the road and take Kappa 4 South buildings? Uh, where the hell is Kappa 4? Kappa 4 South buildings to your immediate west, would you be able to assault that position? Kappa 4 South. Ah, okay, yeah. I received. Affirmative. Doing it. Copy. We should have friendlies pushing on your north shortly as well. Alabaster, Retribution, what is your status? Copy, we had a lot of reports of enemy marines around Kappa 4. Have you engaged them? Last. Four, two, ten. Four, sent. Four is in the position, Epsilon six. Copy. Be advised. 
One, an alabaster to your immediate west break. Three and four to your north. Your orders are to push west towards Beta. Six, ten, move north, take control of Tau 2. Roger, push west towards Beta 6, then push north. Correct. Adjust road as needed if you take fire. Retribution, iron. Iron, send. Destroyed one vehicle, Tango 1, southeast, 20, over. Excellent work. Keep your eyes on that position. I've seen a lot of enemy infantry around that. Affirmative retribution. Be advised, at least one enemy marine, Tango 1, southeast, uh, compound, over. Good copy. Two, this is 10. Enemy vehicle destroyed. You should be able to move now. This is Retribution 2, Sig on your last. Enemy vehicle on the hill has been destroyed. You can resume your movement. I'll copy. Copy. Be advised, we've taken casualty uh, at this time. We're just uh, working those casualties. We'll push to the far side of Kappa 3 if that works for you. Copy. Sounds good. Have you seen Retribution 3? This is three on that. Three, status and position. Uh, Two space marines running at us. Right, we're currently at the northwestern north edge of K3. Space marines are bowling down on Space marines are literally on top of Retribution 2 at this time. We have. Everybody's dead. Copy. Kappa 3, I repeat. Kappa 3, enemy space marines. Alabaster, I need you to move north and clear that compound immediately. There's a hurt push for one of the down. Alabaster, move north. Heretic Astartes at Kappa 3 reported in. Move in and engage the enemy. Retribution right, 10, this is right, push of one. We have taken kilo 4. Uh, we could move to Bravo 6 and to Tango 2. 4 is moving to Bravo 6 at this time. Cover them if they take fire. If not, to move northwest Tango 2 yourself. I'll copy. Let's push one call. Three reporting. Two managed to take off the Space Marines. We should be secure on a position at the northern edge of K3. Copy. Push west. Clear Kappa 5. Get eyes west. I'll copy. Is there any medic close to Chimera? Or I believe F1 would be the nearest friendly squad to your position. Retribution, Iron over. Iron, sent. Relatively low on ammunition, still east of Amasar quarters marker, northeast of Echo 7, southwest of Kilo 1, on the road facing west, no contact, over. Copy, I believe we defeated the enemy's main force for now. Head back to base and rearm. I'll copy. Iron. 10, this is 3. We're currently pushing west from K5. We're moving up the hill towards Havelock 17. Good work. Friendlies to your southwest. Copy that. Man, Alabaster. Alabaster, send. Three strong. Kilo 3. Watching the west. Ready to push. Over. Copy. Push, push, push. Tau 1. Then onward to Tau 3. The Emperor projects. Retribution 10, Retribution 2. 2, send. Uh, we killed the Space Marines, but uh, we're 3 strong now. Over. You still want us pushing, or do you want us uh, holding? I want you pushing with Alabaster to Tau 1. Straight west to Tau 1. Emperor protects. Code actual, Step talk to me. Reporting. Uh, knocked out enemy MSP. Four minutes for off. MSP. MSP is now in echo. I will get you a count, but I think this is going to be our last one. Should be enough. I think we are 
fighting in the objective right now. Retribution, iron. Iron, send it. RTB, over. Copy last, my lord. Keep pushing west, clear the buildings. The entire force is converging to that objective right now. Squad at uh, Beta 6. Do you have a medic with you? I'm gonna see about getting the MSP closer. Okay, so from uh, leadership elements, I, I'm actually very pleased that we were able to deliver the city to the emperor. Although I was expecting us to be to run out of tickets, uh, our initial attack to the first objective uh, failed with heavy casualties, and our first attempt to take the townhouse also ended with with an al almost complete squad wipe, or force wipe. So we were pleading a lot of tickets. So. I was positively surprised by the fact that we were able to push the enemy out of the city. Uh, so, I mean, I was expecting us to take casualties. The terrain really didn't allow us to do much, much flanking, particularly the townhouse was pretty hard to approach because of the park. But uh, I didn't have like a sense of how many casualties we are causing to the enemy, since I only, only got the losses that we we had over the earlier, which is a fairly common issue when in command. Uh, I think good news, at least from my perspective, the ra uh, radio network functioned, even though we had six, well, six separate elements on the command, like not count the, com not count the commissar, so potentially even seven, how you want to view it, which is a lot more than we usually do. But it was fairly good. And people were also giving reports on their own volition and squad leaders trying to do each other horizontally, which was nice. Uh, we also managed to get uh, logistics when good for the ammunition. Our tech priest had to leave. Um, unfortunately, we re really had trouble setting up the MSPs because the ranges in the city were so low that the enemy was fairly was very easily able to contest it, which meant that we had a decent amount of walking from the assembly area. But the map was so small that that didn't really cripple us in any way. So we can thank the Emperor for that. So with that, I was, in general, I was pleased with how the task force worked. Even after we suffered, as I said, two failed attempts, people were still at relatively high morale and coming up with suggestions how we, how we, we would be able to advance forward. So that was nice to see, and that paid off for us in victory. Uh, what I was less pleased about is that we did have some disciplinary infractions, and rather than face their rightful punishment, these people decided to run away instead of facing the commissar. So that's unacceptable, and if we had the AR, we would send the military police after them. But since the AR is down, they may be able to get scots free at this time. Unfortunately. Blasphemy. Indeed. Will the AR be going up later? Heretics! As I understood, I don't think we are getting any at all. No! Yeah. Um, what I would like to hear from the squad leaders, as we get to you shortly, is that what caused the most amount of casualties? Was it like normal infantry fights? Was it the enemy's suppressive fire from the tall buildings, be it the manufacturing room or at the townhouse? Or was it the enemy space marines? Since I have no idea what actually caused us to lo caused us our dead. So that, that is something that I wish to hear from you guys. Uh, other than that, uh, by us, would you like to add anything? Um, there was a couple uh, communications issues in which I had to move over uh, and uh, talk uh, directly with squads. I think uh, maybe the combat or something else affected people's capabilities of listening to the radio. Uh, Reveille was 
giving clerical commands as far as I understand, but sometimes I had to run over to several different squads and tell them personally, hey, do this. But besides that, I didn't have any issues with anybody. Maybe a bit more courage, everyone. Who cares if you die? Run. <laughs> that is true. We had to encourage some people to move there as once or twice. Uh, <gasps> all right. With that, um, I think uh, Retribution 1 had to leave. Uh, Retribution 2, are you here? Yep. And so uh, biggest generator of casualties for us, I would say uh, number one, Space Marines. Followed by two, friendly plasma guns. And then three, it's just like, we got mulched when we were moving. Uh, we didn't have a whole lot of support at some times. And I think that was the same for everybody. But uh, yeah, that'd be the largest generators of casualties for us. The very end, we got fucked up. They charged us to, uh, two abreast right into the, the center of our squad. And basically, we were watching torsos and bodies flying all over the place. It's pretty, it awesome. uh, <laughs> it's pretty fucking awesome. All right, anything you wish to add on like platoon level? Oh, you guys were awesome. Uh, we got our ammunition when we needed it. Obviously, having to walk from the spawn was a bit of a pain in the ass at times for keeping cohesion. But ultimately, uh, you know, I agree with your point. The town being small definitely benefit us on that. Uh, that'd be basically it. You guys did fine. I think we, we, we probably would have done better with a bit more fire support in a way. Maybe if they gave us a little bit of light mortar, that would have been making the townhouse less of a uh, meat grinder. But uh, that's about it, basically. It was awesome. This was a great experience. My first time playing a 40k mission. So like my, my hair is blown back. I'm having a great time. All right, thank you. Retribution 3. Hello. Uh, it went fine from, uh, from our end. Uh, most of the casualties, in my opinion, were just due to enemies being in entrenched positions, either just Mostly it was people being on second and third floor of uh, specific buildings, either being the, uh, I think, E2, the, the townhouse, and then the uh, the other one to the southwest, um, the first one we encountered. That was like most of the casualties that we took for long uh, long periods. We didn't have any incidents when it came to CQB or friendly fire, that kind of thing. And most of the proper wipes that we had was just due to us being attrition in a position where we tried to take you know, shots at them, but they, they did have the advantage. Uh, when it came to it, I think everything went completely fine. Uh, cohesion was kind of hard to follow sometimes, but I simply blame it on it being like a very urban environment and sidelines being limited. Plus, uh, just due to the nature of the fact that people were just moving position, orders were changing uh, just due to like how it was on the ground pretty frequently. Therefore, trying to grasp an idea of where friendly units was without them calling out their position or being pinged about it was kind of hard to follow sometimes, but it never really arose as a as a main issue while playing. Um, nothing too specific, and it 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 is a shame that the AR is not working, but that's about it for us. Yeah, I mean that's probably the positioning is probably just an artifact of you having a lot of other things on your mind, leading your squad in combat. We in the command team had pretty good idea where everybody was at all times. So that just means that you couldn't follow up because you know you were in battle, had your own mm -hmm. squad, own squad to boss around. There was only one time we lost the squad, right? Four. Every day, every day, every time, I think we had a good idea where everyone was. Well, I mean, during the assault on Soundhouse, oh, first assault pretty much ended, everybody dying. So that took a while to establish. But anyway, oh, one more thing. Go ahead. Uh... PAD was pretty easy, and uh, that, I do think that helped a lot when it came to the CQB uh, scenarios. Right. Kind of unrelated, but uh, was one of the things. All right, good to know. Thank you, Retribution 3, Retribution 4. Uh, those that have that much to add. I believe we got killed mostly by the, the suppressive fire. Anything you wish we would have done differently? It was like more mission side, but it it was designed that way. Like the narrowest part of the is the hey, most open part up. of the mission, <laughs> crossing the open areas towards the townhouses. But I understand that's more like a mission design thing. All right, thank you. In that case, Aaron. 
Well, our tech priest sorted our Promethean reactor problem at the beginning of the mission. Uh, it was actually fairly good fun. There were a few times we were killed, and for some reason the kills that occurred were that we didn't actually understand what killed us. So it was a one shot, one kill type of situation. Not sure what it was. But Iron focused on staying on main, on some of the main roads and maintaining supremacy on the roads, especially on the end of the mission. I think uh, that paid off because we were able to kill a few enemy marines, just being a bit too careless. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure how useful we were from the perspective of the infantry guys. Well, I think that you were vital when you were on station suppressing that sound house, even if the attack failed, because. We just needed somebody to host those windows up otherwise approaching would have been and would have been and was suicide about the one shot kill it wasn't a grenade i can't remember if the rocket launcher can one shot you if it hits right okay but most likely yes i believe uh, were we useful to the infantry guys because it was a bit difficult for us to follow where you are and we were trying to prevent enemy movement along the MSRs. Uh, two here. Between you guys and us, on that northern end where Delta-6 had that those buildings to the west of it, like we locked down their entire movement. They weren't able to use that MSR at all. And then between that and the auto gun fire on the uh, on the hard points around it, I think we, we did a lot. The AAR doesn't really give us a... Like, we have no AAR, so we can't really go back and look at what actually happened. But from our perspective... You guys were doing a hell of a job suppressing that lane, and that I think kept them from reinforcing the townhouse. We did which have let us a, push through it. We did have a major problem with the some of the map assets. Basically, the trees rendered for the gunners, and and at least for me as a command, for me as a commander, that the trees rendered in such a way that it was almost impossible to see the townhouse from that eastern part of the park. It was very difficult to shoot at it. Which was kind of weird, considering the distances involved. But it was good fun, to be perfectly honest. Killing a few of those nasty heretic marines. Yeah, and I think you also got at least one vehicle. Uh, probably three, actually. Nice. But I think those were uh, MSPs or something? They had transport trucks, at least. Yeah. All right, uh, thank you. And that, then we have the Honorable Alabaster. Hey everybody, I turned the voice filter off so you can actually understand some of the words I say today. It was a great time overall, I'd say for myself. Uh, my feedback is that I left my brain with the Emperor at the beginning and some of our initial charges to assist the infantry with the overall game plan being for us to remain in reserve and then push his shock, shock troops and help uh, break contest. It didn't go well because we attempted a flank that ended up going just straight up off the map. That was horrible for me and if you're wondering why we kind of stagnated as a team at the beginning there. That was one of the reasons. Uh, as the operation went on, we had a lot of moments preventing our job as shock troops, or so I thought, where a space marine would kind of go down in a poke fight we maybe overcommitted to from afar, and that prevented us from assisting during some key moments. But thankfully for the second half of the, of the, second half of the operation, rather, we unfucked ourselves a little bit. And especially on that townhouse push, I'm happy to say we actually felt like we were really, really helping there. And onwards. So I hope we were a help in the second half, and for the first half, I'm sorry about all the little hiccups and slip-ups. As for you guys, uh, all the infantry commanders, I mean, I'm not just going to, like, pat Lurch on the back. Everybody did a great job, but Lurch, I saw you leading from the front, and that was some awesome stuff to bear witness to. From the platoon lead on it. down, I don't really have any complaints. You guys seemed very well coordinated, and when I was communicating, well, when you could understand my dulcet tones being filtered not only through fucking Space Marine Vox, but also through the TFAR radios, it worked out pretty well. Yeah, we and had... I have some Mission Maker feedback, but I'll redirect that to the Mission Maker. Yeah, we had no problem understanding you, except you had propensity of um, not following our directive exactly, which was a bit confusing at times. But uh, we managed. Are there any specific instances you think we might still have a disconnect on anything uh, you remember we're yeah, talking about when we were trying to flank the townhouse from the west side you decided to head or from the east side you decided to head direct east only to find out that the way is blocked which was known to us but then uh, i believe i sent by us to explain you what the game plan was and you understood and then you relocated your squad uh, hey guys yeah i get uh, i get you 
what is the current situation on your debriefing? We're pretty much finishing up here. Okay. Uh, I'm going to call in the rest of the guys. Yeah, you can wrap that sounds it good. up. But yeah, as I said, no great problems with Alabaster. Obviously, leader went down occasionally, such as life in combat. And uh, I mean, definitely there were... I mean, definitely there was a few times when you guys were dead, when we needed you, but as I said, I'm not going to blame that necessarily on anybody. In that was I mean, for you guys not to overcome it, that is true. But I want... It's kind of hard for me to tell when when or if that ever actually happened. There was a situation in the townhouse, which uh, honestly, I don't think it's a big deal at all. Like, uh, Whale was down. Uh, a bunch of chaos fucking cultists around you, so that was badass to fucking walk into that room. Uh, but uh, the rest of the squad was like, kind of like, Alabaster was like walking around without much of leadership, and I just told them where the enemy were, and I fucking told them to spread out. I mean, everybody listened, everybody was right, but... Yeah. The loss of leadership does cause a bit of stun, you know, like people kind of get a bit stunned by that. Bart, anyway, I believe people are still in here, so... Excuse me, one moment. Uh, can Retribution 1 say something? Go ahead. Thanks. So I was just another trooper there, so I'll say three points. First of all, I never saw a commissar urging us forward because I believe we were always just rushing towards the enemy. And the second point is that uh, I believe we had uh, very good information where our own troops are all the time, but then what the enemy positions are and how strong they are, that was the, uh, the downside. Uh, Alicandru? The There's like a, sorry. There's filtered chewing. Someone's got a hot mic. It's Alicandru. It's an echo. Sorry about that. Okay, and the third point was that we made a couple of, well, probably only two suicide charges where the order was to go forward and everybody said that that's suicide, we're gonna die immediately. And then the answer was for the emperor. So I'm not sure if that was the squad leaders uh, take on the East uh, situation or the platoon leaders, but where well, we did a couple of complete suicide charges. Well, that... But other... Otherwise, it was really fun, so thanks. I mean, we were never told by any of the squad leaders that they can't make a move. I mean, we were, but like, for example, Alpha 1 never said to us that they cannot make a move, so it's kind of hard to answer that question, since we were not purposefully sending people to their deaths. Yeah, I never I never told people what? to rush forward and die. <laughs> I think that was the thing. It's like, we, we were initially like... Uh we were real loose with how we were playing it because we wanted to be the fucking meat grinder space marine fodder right and then towards the back half when i real what i think we all realized our ticket count was depleting we started to kind of tighten up and that's where we really came into our own yeah and that's when everybody tightened up well, i mean sir the... the mission intent was for us to you know push through in a concentrated lane i was expecting as, as i said we've never purpose no, no squad leader ever said to us that we're gonna die, die if we make this move and so Anyway, I mean, I had that's to, what's I had, worth. I had to force people to hold position. I was like shouting at people to hold the line, especially around the hangar one, hangar two. But that's that's about it. Never told anyone to rush ahead into the open to die. <laughs> anyway, uh, so yeah, that's probably um, squad leaders overcommitting. Well, not overcommitting. Squad leaders following. In squad leaders enthusiastically following our orders, with us not having. a Good idea that that is um, complete no go. Anyway, their hate of the heretic. Yeah, they uh, had the commissar forward. behind them too. <laughs> that is true. But if I read this correctly, you are basically done. With yes, we are. Uh, okay, uh, if you don't mind, uh, I will start quickly uh, with my one or two admin takes. And after that, uh, we can let the defending side leader, Lusot, start. Uh, so, as usual, uh, this was our second time uh, using the Bahama 40,000 mod repositories, meaning that there is also a certain amount of risk that the mission is going basically broken. Uh, this time, uh, we got again a bit lucky. At least I didn't see anything clearly game-breaking going on during the mission. 
there was the usual teleport uh, teleportation with MSB tele uh, teleporting players inside buildings and stuff like that, which I tried to fix as quickly as I could. Uh, the only real uh, problem with the mission was that it seems that the There is Only War mod doesn't actually include the ACE medical functions with their own medical, you know, models, uh, which I tried to correct during the mission uh, with ACE model setting the correct players as medicals. Uh, I think overall both sides did quite well, but Lusot, can you open up your how you planned your own defensive lines and how you think it well uh, went during the mission itself? Well, my general plan was that in the beginning we would try to uh, create a lot of space in and in turn give you a lot of casualties, essentially falling back while fighting. And then once we reach uh, the big tower in front of the townhouse, we would take a more uh, firm stance and try to hold the ground there. As the uh, there's a little, only a little area where your infantry can pass through with any sort of cover, and we didn't ex or I didn't expect you to suicide charge across the field. Sorry, across the park. Uh, so basically, our plan consisted of a uh, yeah. I mean, that's basically it. Uh, the way it ended up working for us is that the first part went pretty okay. Maybe stayed a bit too long, but we went to slow it down a bit. And then when we pulled back to the tower area, we held that for a while before uh, eventually that falling. And then we took our place in the townhouse and we held that for a long time, probably too long. We took way too many casualties there. And then you ended up uh, reducing our ticket count to almost zero. So we had to pull back and then we never really got a good second or third defensive line going there and then not just being destroyed sorry i accidentally left the channel i don't have much more to say about the plan okay uh Rebel, before you start i'm going to going to quickly mention that unfortunately our after action report uh, software is currently bricked because the latest cba update uh, broke it. Uh, to my understanding, there might still be a small chance that we can upload uh, the tonight's mission, but I might be wrong about that and I will inform uh, on the RMIO channel at a later time. Okay, sorry about that, uh, Reveli, go ahead. All right, Bureau uh, Recognition Commander here. So. Planning for this um, problem for me was is that the game area was really narrow, so there weren't weren't too many opportunities for any type of flanking attacks. So my intent was is that we can try to push our squads in a narrow lane as possible and then just use fire superiority uh, to gain crown. At the very start of the mission, uh, based on the terrain, there was a chance that we would be able to assault from the west side without you guys being detected, but you had left observers further back. Around the, around the second objective that was un unfortunately revealed at moments. Our first assault on the manufacturer room um, kind of failed, but uh, we kept the pressure and we were then able to take it. And the same formula repeated in the townhouse. Our first attack on the townhouse was pretty much a complete force wipe on our side, but in the second assault achieved more results. Um, in general, speaking to my squad leaders, the biggest casualty generators for us was the enemy, heretic space marines, and long-range fire from the tall buildings. Those seem to have been the two greatest casualty generators for us. Uh, we obviously did have our own iron, our counter IPC, that we used basically as a main battle tank, which was crucial sometimes, but we also had some problems with the, uh, particularly in the townhouse, with the trees at the park blocking effective long-range usage of the tank. And the townhouse definitely was the most hardest part for the map for us, because as Lusot said, the really the only viable assault route was at the extreme south edge, 
I did have one squad usually operating on the north side, trying to just distract you guys, drawing some fire from the main elements. Other than that, I guess I could comment on our Space Marine usage. So our intent was is that we're going to make contact with the infantry and the tank, and then we're going to have the Space Marines in reserve to either duel with the enemy Space Marines, since they should be able to win that fight due to numerical advantage, or to do like flanking surprise sock assault on identified enemy strong points. Now, the only time this really worked was the second townhouse assault. We were able to push our own white scars front. And they were in that position like badass. That looked really, really nice. But other than that, it was a bit harder to do in practice than in, than in the planning. Um, it was very easy for, for them to get engaged and suffer like one or two casualties for a long range firefight, which greatly decreased there. Combat effectiveness. Other than that, uh, we did lose our own vehicle a couple of times, which I presume was to the enemy and tank rockets. I hope we never the enemy got never so far as to throw hand grenades. Speaking of the enemy getting close, logistically our greatest challenge was is that the map was or the game area was so small, and because of the angle that the game area took is is that enemy was pretty much always able to contest our MSP. So almost every respawn wave had to walk back from the base instead of teleporting anywhere in the field. So in hindsight, having just a transport truck would have been more useful for us. That's on me. I made a miscalculation of the range of the contested, yeah. contested radius. Yeah. But on the other hand, the small map also works the other way, in that you know walking from the respawn area wasn't that big of a ask because the area was so small. So, that was nice. Uh, one thing that I guess I could, would like to hear from the op for side was that what caused... You said that you suffered a lot of casualties defending the townhouse. Like, what caused that? Were we shooting grenade launchers and plasma rifles through windows to kill your guys in the buildings? Or was it just normal infantry fights? Or was it our tank? And secondly, was there, like, grander tactical plan for the usage of the plague grid and zombies? That we encountered a few times because when we did encounter the monstrosities that seemed to happen at times when we were not in contact with the rest of the defenders so were those like completely uncontrollable element for you or were they integrated as part of the plan uh, as for the zombies uh i'll let firex answer that but um i'm sadly i'm not exactly sure of the date of the casualties that we took at the town hall. I think it was mostly long range fire, especially with grenades and plasma rifles. But uh, I, I sadly, I just don't know. And that's we don't have the AR. I can't really get you better information. But personally, Chaos Space Marine lead here. There was a lot of plasma fire and that wrecked all hell in a big area around it when it had landed. So it, it was basically like another grenade launcher. So. Yeah. Uh, I think that's the bulk of the casualties we took. Yeah, I, would I think that might have been me, heretic. <laughs> Personally, I mostly died to either a uh, random infantryman sniping me in the head from across the park, or a bunch of grenades standing on top of my body at the same time. As a chaos marine, I would say that definitely the biggest single threat to us was the was the tank. Um, two of my three deaths were at least two of my three deaths were to the tank. Um, and secondly, the, of course, the enemy space marines. But that was more of a dual situation when we met them. But the tank, we couldn't do anything about. Well, I mean, actually, I would like to hear from all the space marine. Like, what was the space marine duels like? Uh, well, I would say that um, space marines, at least in my experience from this mission, the space marines could uh, take out each other pretty quickly. Uh, only took a couple of hits with a bolter. To take out, uh, or at least uh, knock unconscious the enemy space marine, and vice versa yeah, when, I I, when I got hit. Um, so that was like it was almost like a normal duel between like in armor basically. Um, when when you were dueling the space marines, obviously yeah. when you were shooting at the infantry, it was more like <laughs> shooting. I mean, cannon fodder basically. The the big um, power disparity is between regular infantry and chaos or or, or space marine. Yeah. So when we when we had the drop on each other, we usually 
you know, whoever shot first yeah, usually exactly. won the duel, basically. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It felt pretty much like like a normal infantry duel in armor, basically. Um, obviously, the the regular infantry was dangerous to us when they had plasma guns and rocket launchers and stuff like that. So it wasn't like they couldn't do anything to us, but like normal infantry popping shots at us with last guns was just something we could basically ignore. Uh, but yeah, the, um, the I've had dangerous. a last gun headshot down people in, my, in the Space Marines for the White Scars. Um, and grenades still worked as well, just fine. Yeah. I, I yeah. guess one mechanic to probably be at play here is that, at least in our squad, Retribution 4 on the attacking side, is that we didn't uh, we didn't, didn't have a very good grasp on like game, me game mechanically, or mod mechanically rather, uh, what we could actually do to the Space Marines. Uh, so sort of a... Uh, that that induced an element of like fear or hesitation to 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 engage the marines and to instead try to just disengage from that kind of situation, which I guess lends it up a bit lore wise, as I suppose the guardsmen would be. They would that they would shit their pants if they saw space marines. So inadvertently, yeah. there was a, like a fear mechanic involved there, which I think yeah. was uh, probably for the better. I think this mod you does the the Warhammer intended balance quite well in so far as a, a squad of guardsmen against the Space Marine. Uh, that's no contest. The Space Marine will win. Uh, so that really works. But we, we still had to be very careful because we couldn't, because of the narrow play area, it worked both ways. It, wor it worked against the attacking side, but it also worked against the defending side because we couldn't really flank and take out the uh, tank with our grenades and do uh, those kinds of maneuvers. What we instead did was we usually uh, hung far back in the defensive lines and reacted to wherever the enemy Space Marines showed up. We went to that area to basically block them from just rushing through our defensive lines. So they. You, you were reacting to us? We were reacting to you. <laughs> yeah, well, I guess it was a bit of both. But w one, one thing we did have to do was make sure that we didn't stand in the open or let you guys spot us first because your plasma cannons, especially when used from long range, we couldn't really see you. You were just lobbing plasma shots. Uh, that was quite deadly in some cases. So we had to stay in good cover and act very defensively, mostly like a regular infantryman. Right. And, there was uh, only one plasma gun. But there was plenty. It was me. We had like well, five in the entire force. Ah, yeah, so th yeah. so there was probably more more than one plasma gun, but you, you I know that at least one space marine had a plasma gun because I I we was at one the wrong end of it. One in each squad once. infantry. Like so, sometimes we had two in each squad because our squad leaders would die, so mm -hmm. we we didn't want to leave the plasma gun behind. It it was too good of a an asset. Yeah, the the, the plasma gun was extremely effective, <laughs> and uh, I yeah, think that's... one one thing that the mod doesn't really show is the the unreliable nature of those weapons. Uh, in... That <laughs> did happen. Uh, oh, we can... uh... Here in Retribution 2, we can speak to the unreliable nature of those plasma guns. Okay, so it did happen. Okay. Oh, yeah. uh, all. Yeah, I'm going to jump in quickly. Okay. So, uh, the mission had what well, Ace overcooking disabled, but I think it was still possible for the plasma gun to detonate uh, when fired. Uh, yes. Also, uh, I'm going to quickly talk about uh, how I used Poxvalkers and other mutants uh, during the mission. Uh, most times I used them, they were kind of a stopgap so that Bluefall couldn't walk freely across multiple uh, city blocks. So they could, so they would have to, you know, clear them before moving on. Uh, I didn't really use that many different mutants. I think I only used the uh, box walkers, and I believe they are called spitters. So basically, you can kind of think of them as uh, mutant ogres that take a lot of shooting before they go down. Uh, yeah, sorry. No, I was I was just about to ask that. How were how were they utilized? Other than that, I don't know if you, um, the Space Marines, uh, the Astartes, do you guys have thermal sights at all on any weapons? 
because in our in our bolters we had thermal sights. Uh, they were basically useless for aiming, but uh, what we did was usually scan the, or at least I did. I scanned the area with the thermal sight, and when I saw something, I started shooting. I think our helmets actually had uh, thermal ability built in as well. Yeah, I think okay, it was. So I think it is. I think it is. Uh, Included in the helmet, but yeah, I might not be wrong. About that. Okay, we had the, I didn't we use had it frequently, III, but yeah, we had the Mark III helmets, and they don't have those built in. Only the okay. more modern versions have it. So we, but we had it on the sight on the bolter. But that has other issues. So basically, the iron sight was the only way to fire accurately. Yeah. But you could use the thermal sight for uh, finding targets and then switching. I mean, to be honest, I guess the fact that Space Marines really can't go prone and sort of big kind of worked in a fire because as I said we were getting pretty good reports where the enemy marines are before they charge into combat so most of the time we were trying to vector in our own white scars to intercept them so I mean so I mean I guess that's basically good for it was good for us that the enemy space marines weren't really able to jump on us and that's also a factor of the narrow game area as well but yeah, I think that's pretty much everything I have to say for here. We all had to be careful. But I had a lot of fun. Yeah, I just want to add one thing. Praise Nurgle. Thank you. Yeah, you can praise him all you want when you take an overcharged plasma to the chest. Praise me. Praise me. Uh, but yeah, uh, thank you for everybody uh, for attending another clusterfuck of a Fulham mission. And I will see you all in the next event, which should be in a couple of weeks, if I'm not mistaken. That was a blast. I, I, I would love to do that again sometime soon. I love the chaos of these uh, missions. It's it, yeah. it, it really works in the Warhammer lore sense in Arma. Because everything is chaos, you die all the time, you know, it just works. Yeah, I mean, even when I got eaten by a fucking building and killed, you know, it's just, it's war fuckery, dude. Yeah, you know? I, I, I was uh, killed by a building as well. A plasma grenade landed in a building and it collapsed and the trigger around the building took me with it. <laughs> I think war, the... Uh, war fuckery. The lower than normal respawn time was a really nice addition to just the chaotic nature of the mission. Yeah, it, really it works. You know, you expect to die a lot in a Warhammer event. That's just how it is. Especially when there's Death Corps of Krieg involved and all of that. The only change I would have made from the attacking side would have been shorten up the uh, MSP's uh, range for uh, being fucked with, because it was in the city. I think a yeah. lot of our respawns had to come out of the spawn anyways, but it wasn't that bad, because it's not a huge map, and the uh, the routes are pretty straightforward, so... Yeah, we, we experienced the same thing on our side. Uh, the first times our MSP malfunctioned and we respawned back at base and had to run. Yeah, but for you, our space I, I understood that you had um, transport vehicles available. Uh, yeah, uh, infantry elements had yep. uh, transport, but they could yep. uh, drive. And we space marines move so fast, it wasn't really an issue for us. But, uh, but later I would on... say that it, it was still quite close. So that's yeah, yeah. We we only had to run for like two or three minutes. So. Yeah. So it it wasn't a big issue for us either. The the map was so small. So, but later on, when the MSP was, uh, uh, it was up in the hab zone for the majority of the mission after that, and uh, our MSP worked fine uh, up until you took the townhouse, uh, somewhere around there. Oh, at the very end there, that charge by the two Chaos Marines. Uh, who was that? Uh, uh, Felix and Metro. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they ran right into uh, our section, uh, Retribution 2. We were uh, we were standing strong at a full stack. Uh, within about five seconds, uh, everybody died. <laughs> Outside of two people. Myself, Felix, or, uh, myself and them. <laughs> we managed to take you fuckers down with us, though. So, I mean, that had... You know, I think I think there was a little bit of suicide crack going on there, but I mean, yeah. we were the last two remaining players 
uh, plus Blizzard, of course, so we kind of decided, okay, we are going to the last prove our worship with a last charge. Yeah, Nurgle didn't raise no bitch. You guys went out swinging, and that's that's respectable. You took one half of... my or uh, eighty percent of my squad with you, but yeah, one of your guys had a plasma gun and uh, managed Yo. to hit Metro with it and took him. Yeah, down. that was Morgan. That was Morgan. He put out no, overcharge and detonated. it. Uh, the last okay. man standing, I managed to just kill myself by falling off a staircase. So, <laughs> uh, not as a glorious end for me. I I, I also did a, a last stand assault. My my character bugged out and I couldn't medic myself and I was bleeding from like everywhere. So I said fuck it, threw away my bolter and uh, managed to charge a commissar, punch him in the face. <laughs> How rude! So it was fun. Uh, I think we killed the commander at one point there, uh, pretty early on. I uh, died a lot. Yeah. yeah, Lusat was basically down about I was 30 to 40% to... of the mission. I was trying to melee you, but the ruins were, were fucky. I couldn't vault over him. I was gonna do uh, like a sick knockout on you. Oh, right. I don't think uh, I was back close to someone, but you might have. Also, why, who are the two why, people? White Scar, guys. Did you guys radios work with the rest of your platoon? Because we were basically a comms blackout. We couldn't talk to any of the regular infantry on our side. We were on our own. Well, you had uh, no radio backpack because it's TFAR. So what you needed to do, what we did, was just set an additional net on the shortwave. We, we did that. And I talked to him. That's weird. Yeah, we, uh, we, maybe there was a radio code incompatibility, or maybe the radios weren't the same side radios. One of those Some, two, probably. Something, something along those lines happened, but I could only talk to uh, Felix, basically. So we we thought, oh shit, there's fire over there, and Lucid went on to our um, uh, short wave sometimes and said, uh, the white scars are over there, move there, and we did. And that was basically yeah, just the, thinking, the, all the coordination we had, so it was very chaos-like, you know, ooh, there's fighting over there, let's go. Yeah, I guess a hotline from you to platoon, or just picking up a second radio for your group lead and doing some very irritating radio swapping. Yeah, it was something with the platoon net itself, because I could talk with them just fine on a, on their net, but they couldn't get on the platoon net, and we couldn't mm -hmm. figure what, out why it seemed to work when they... Yeah, the, the only one I heard on platoon was... Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> which is really weird. Uh, yeah, but he was also Space Marine, though, so I might have something to do with it. I think the Space Marine helmet or whatever radio uh, function is in built in there bugged out on our side. But anyway, yeah. it didn't really matter much. We still could react just fine to everything. Uh, but yeah, uh, thank you. I'm going to leave now, and I will see you all, at least hopefully, in two weeks. Thanks all right. for the game. See you. Yep. Great up, guys. Thank you for yeah. it. See you all. Um, thank you. Disconnected. Uh, you on the border of Amateur Quarters. Copy, you can. Your sister, my friend.